Hello, I'm Edward Tart, math teacher. I have a math challenge for you with prizes available. As a private math tutor, one of the things I do for some students is help them prepare for the SAT, the Scholastic Aptitude Test, the math part. And I do this primarily by going over with them sample test questions. I recently ran across a sample question that attracted my interest and I decided to modify it and make it somewhat harder and then present it to you as a challenge. So here it is. <clears throat> we have a sequence of numbers. Every number in the sequence is a positive integer. Positive integers means 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and so on indefinitely. This sequence goes on indefinitely. Every positive integer is in the sequence. For example, this positive integer is in the sequence. After the initial 1, every number in the sequence is equal to or greater than the number immediately preceding it. For example, this 3 is equal to the number right before it. This 4 is greater than the number right before it. Every integer n in the sequence appears exactly n times. For example, the integer 3 appears exactly three times. The integer 37 appears exactly 37 times. This integer appears exactly this many times. Notice the first appearance of the integer 4 is in position number 7. That is, it is the first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh number in the sequence. And now we're coming up to the question. This integer, 1,713, has its first appearance in the sequence in position number k. What is the value of k. If you can answer that, I'd like to know your answer. In order for you to be a winner and be eligible for a prize if you want it, I ask that you not use a computer program. I would prefer that you do all your work just with pencil and paper, but if you do feel the need of using a calculator, use a calculator for only a few seconds. Also, I will want to know how you got your answer, and if you use a formula, I will want you to tell me why your formula works. If you can do all this, please do not do it here at the comments section of this video. Instead, go to my profile page, click on Send Message, and message me your answer. If you are correct, you can have a prize if you want it. The prize that I offer is an audio file of me playing a piano selection that I recorded many years ago. If you need help deciding whether you would like a prize, you can go to the Piano Videos playlist at my profile page and watch one or more of those videos. If you do want a prize, be sure to include your email address and request the prize. If you work on this challenge, I hope that it will give you mental stimulation and pleasure. Thank you for watching this video.